Let's take a look at finding the mean of data on a TI-34 multi-view calculator. Now specifically, we're going to find the mean of the following data. So let's go input it in. So on this calculator, uh, we'll go into the data button. Now you may already have data here, and if you do, you can press uh, delete to clean out each individual one. If you want to do it real fast, you can press your data one more time, and you see how there's a clear L1, clear L2. If I push enter on clear one, it'll clear out L1. And if I push data again, if I down arrow to clear L2 and press enter on it, it'll clear out L2. So a very quick way you can clean it out. Okay, we're going to put in 13 and 19. So I do 13, enter, 19, enter, 23 and 31. So 23, enter, 31, enter. 45 and 46, so 45, enter, 46, enter, 47, 51, so 47, enter, 51, enter, and 53, enter. Okay, now I'd recommend going, you do an up arrow and going through and double checking all your numbers and so forth. And we'll assume I did it right. That's not always a good assumption, but we'll assume it this time. And we'll exit out. So we'll do second mode. So you have to enter your numbers in first. Now I see above the data says stat. So if I do my second data, it'll go into this. And we got uh, one set of numbers, just the X values. Uh, so we won one of our stats. Now if you're given a pair of numbers, like X's and Y's, you'd choose two of our stats. So we want one of our stats. Press enter on it. Now first thing it's asking is where do we put our data? And we put it in L1, so that's, that's fine. Leave it that way. If you put in L2, you'd right arrow over to that, put your flashing cursor on L2, and press enter one time. Now, frequency is set at 1, and, and for our purposes, we'll always have set it equal to 1. This would be if you had 218 year olds, instead of entering 18 200 times, you would put 18 in L1, and you'd put 200 in L2, your frequency, how many 18 year olds you have. Um, I doubt if you'll ever work with uh, numbers that huge where you need to work with to use this use the second option. And then I'll down arrow to calculate. If you do have numbers that huge, usually you're not using the TA-34, you're using Excel. And I'll press calculate. Now this second one right here, this is our mean. So our answer would be 36.44 if we round it two decimal places. Now this, how you read this, this says X bar. Now specifically that says sample mean. That's what X bar represents. Uh, but the same formula you use for sample mean is what you use for population mean. So it doesn't matter what the problem's asking for, uh, sample mean or population mean, you still find the same one. And that's our answer. And that's how you find the mean on a TI-34 TI uh, calculator.